project to build a, an electric car sort of started at the end of 2015 where we took on a few university students uh, to run their final year projects into researching what it, what it requires and what it takes to actually uh, design and, and build an electric race car. So I just completed a quite a thrilling experience. I started off slowly, I didn't end up terribly fast, but boy the acceleration through the little straight on the figure of eight, uh, the really tight steering controls, the very powerful brakes. So overall, it was an extraordinary experience. Now it's set for competition in, in December, two weeks time. SAE is one of the biggest engineering competitions in the world. Uh, there's over 600 different universities that actually compete. Uh, yeah, so it's sort of broken down into several different events. It's not just a competition of the design of a race car, but it also looks at the engineering practices and everything that goes into it and the management of the teams and the structures. The best way to do a project very, very well is to do something you're enjoying and that is meaningful. And obviously these students, you just look at their faces, look at the work that they're producing, they are loving what they're doing and I've been speaking to them, there's 65 in the team, they're spending a huge number of hours above and beyond the normal study hours to do this. The skills that you get from this project are unparalleled to anything else I've done in my time at university. And you can't do it properly unless you understand power systems engineering and control systems engineering, mechanical engineering on steroids. You have to be good engineers to do this. So you've got a classic case now of young people, students being motivated to learn because they know what they're going to apply that learning towards. Nothing could be better.